In front of me is over 100 unopened baseball card packs that I'm going to be opening up all in one sitting to see how many hits, serial number cards, big cards we can pull in today's video to end out 2023 with a bang. What is going on guys? It's Eagleman here. Welcome to the channel. This is a pretty big video as we open up 100 packs all in one sitting. It's going to be a longer video but we got a lot to open up, so let's go ahead and get started. If you're new to the channel though, hit that subscribe button. We do all sorts of sports card content on the channel like this. Let's get it going. We got 100 packs, all sorts of variety of products here to be opening up. We got tons of these 2021 galleries, so let's go ahead and get those going right away. Like I said, the goal of this is to try and find as many hits as possible. I've been doing a 2023 goals list where I'm trying to find so many hits, serial numbered cards, big hits, and we've got some work to do, needless to say. So we're trying to crank out as many of those goals as we can. Hopefully 100 packs can suffice a lot of those goals. But thank you guys very much for tuning in for this video. It's been a lot of fun opening up packs this past year in 2023. But this is going to be quite the bang all in one video. So hopefully we can find something good. Comment down below your predictions for what we're going to pull today. Any big hits, any cool serial number cards. Hopefully that is the case. So I got 10 packs of 2021 Topps Gallery here. These are all retail packs. So we, we have uh, no hobby packs in here. So there's no guarantee of hits or anything like that. We are facing the odds today. So hopefully they are in our favor as we open up our last pack of 2021 Topps Gallery. These are all from Blaster Boxes, by the way. So here we go. 2021 Topps Gallery. Let's get it going. Derek Jeter is going to lead us off. Austin Meadows printer proof. Oh my gosh, the third card into the video, we get a Lodi, Leody Tavares, rookie card auto. That's amazing. Numbered out of 99, it's a green one. Let me sleeve this one up real quick. We're starting the video out with a bang, right away with an autograph. Leody Tavares, rookie auto, green out of 99. I love it. Beautiful looking card. We'll set that off to the side. And I'm going to make a pile of all the inserts and parallels in one. We'll make a pile of like the good cards. So we'll do a recap at the end. So if you're not interested in watching all, however long this video is going to be, 30, 40 minutes, whatever, you can go ahead and skip to the end. We'll do a recap. We've got Andre Semenez rookie card. I love that. We've got a next wave, Bo Bichette, Machado, Griffey, Byron Buxton, Brady Singer rookie printer proof. That's not terrible. Uh, a couple more. Mike Trout printer proof. I'll put that in the good pile. Very nice. Brady Singer's George Brett parallel right there. It's like some sort of foil. We got a MLB Originals, Babe Ruth insert, very nice. Luis Robert, uh, double Noni Arnado. This one's a printer proof. And there's a Jose Ramirez, my man, Jose. Love to see it. It's a rainbow foil of some sort. We got Frank Tom Jordan Alvarez, printer proof there. Masters of the Craft, it looks like Pujols there. Yep, Pujols, we got George Brett. Andrew Vaughn, Trey Mancini, and then Ryan McMahon. Nice, we get an auto from our first product. That's pretty amazing. Let me sleeve up this Mike Trout printer proof. I know it's kind of a pain in the butt to sleeve the cards in the video, but I do like to protect them as we go along here. Okay, so that was a good success there. That was a pretty good start. Let's go ahead and switch it over to some unlicensed product. We've got five packs of 2022 Mosaic. Underrated product, in my opinion. I've always enjoyed opening up... Uh, the Mosaic and the Panini products as of late. They've got some good parallels. It's hard to find something that's serial numbered, but you can still find some good looking parallels and a potential at some autographs. I'll also try and keep um, updating the screen with the odds of some cards we just pulled, like that autograph. Hopefully I, I updated you guys with the odds of pulling that particular type of card, just so that's easier for you guys and hopefully more entertaining. I also like doing it on my own research, um, my own behalf. So here we go with the last pack of 2022 Mosaic. Let's see what we can find. I do see some color hiding in there. Pretty exciting. We're going to lead off with the Adelis Garcia, Guerrero, Marte, Anthony Rizzo, Green. Get a Romy Gonzalez. That's like a blue camo rookie. Get a U Darvish Aces insert. Robbie Ray, Lindor, Kyle Mueller, Edmund, David Fletcher. That's another camo blue. It's a Hollow Fame insert. Shane Bieber, McCormick, Wilson, Nate Valdi. It's just a Mosaic Prism. Robin Yount, Hall of Fame Green, Hall of Fame Maddox. I mean, there's lots of inserts and there's lots of parallels, but it can be overwhelming a lot. There's Josh Donaldson, Prism there, Trevor Story, Blue Camo, Matt Manning, Rookie Debut. There's Notani, Most Valuable Player. 
Going to the Dodgers and a pretty big deal. So that's pretty exciting. Tariq Skubal Green, Johan Duran, rookie oh, blue there. That's, that one's not terrible. He's a pretty good uh, relief pitcher. Close there. Freddie Freeman, bang, insert. So I'll sleeve up this Johan Duran. Nothing much came from Mosaic. This Duran rookie is pretty cool, though. So I'll sleeve that one up, and we'll move on to the next product. You can't even see all the cards on, or all the packs on the screen, that is, because there's just so much going on. But we'll open up these ones over here, 2021 Series 2. These are all somewhat modern-day packs as well from 2021 to 2023. Uh, do I have any 2020? I don't think I do have any 2020 cards. But yeah, there's quite the variety of brands. We go from Panini, we go from Tops. No upper deck or anything like that. They don't really make baseball cards anymore. But we do get some Donruss, we get some Optic, we get some Gypsy Queen, Chrome, Big League, Gallery, Archives, Chrome Platinum Anniversary, Stadium Club, uh, Top Series 1, Series 2, uh, did I say them all? We already saw Mosaic. So yeah, we got lots coming out. So this is five packs of, or is this ten packs? Yeah, five packs, 2021 Series 2. I've opened up a bunch of this on the channel already. So this is uh, probably repeating myself here, but hopefully I can find something good. We got the Juan Soto in the loop stuff. A couple more inserts here. Let me know if I miss anything as well, because you guys have better eyes than I do, and I've got a lot going on right now. So if I miss anything, let me know. Comment down below. Man, I, this, this design is so hard to read, but we do get a serial numbered card here. We get Mark Melon, Melancon. It's out of 499, so that's pretty nice. We'll sleeve that one up. Mount Castle rookie insert. Got a couple more base cards here. I'm not going to pay too much attention to the base cards because I don't think there's any crazy, uh, crazy inserts or, or rookies we can get. Roger Maris, 70 years of tops. That was kind of cool. 2017 design. These ones sell for pretty well, actually. So I'll sleeve that one up, and we'll keep on moving here. I know one of those packs felt pretty thick handling it. So we'll see if there's uh, something crazy in there. A couple inserts, nothing. Nothing wild. There's a Brent Rooker rookie card. He's actually he had a decent season last year with Oakland, so that was good to see. A couple more base cards. Here's a Cabrian Hayes rookie. And out of 2021, so we got a gold card here of Corbin Burns. Very nice. Another serial number card for us. So that's a Corbin Burns gold there. Juan Soto, Shane Bieber inserts. And we'll end it out with a couple more base cards. Very nice. So we got two serial number cards. A nice insert there with the Roger Maris. Let me sleeve these ones up. We'll move all the cards. Like I said, we will be doing a recap at the end to, to showcase everything. So don't feel like uh, if you missed out or if you want to skip to the end. Totally fine with me. I'm just here to entertain you guys and entertain myself, really. So looking forward to the 2024 year. I'll produce another goal list, so subscribe and stay tuned for next year's goals coming. All right, let's open up these archives packs. We have 10 2022 Tops Archives. What actually one of my favorite products from last year, and a lot of it went on clearance at Walmart and I think Target, I don't know. But a lot of it went on clearance, so I was scooping up as much of it as I could because I love this product so much. So we'll open up these. I pulled a number of autographs from these already. Really good rookie class to it. You got Steven Kwan, uh, Julio Rodriguez, a couple other guys in there. And there's some good parallels as well. Good designs. So we'll crank through a bunch of these. All right, we'll open up this one. Then we'll do the next five. Again, we got 10 packs of these. So I'll flip through them real quick. Hopefully I can find a nice parallel out of these. Got a couple inserts in there. I haven't been doing well. There we go. Julio Rodriguez, rookie, started off. Very nice. We'll take that. Buxton, Blackman. We got a Trey Mancini. This is a uh, serial number card, if I am correct. Yes, out of 199. Trey Mancini. Very nice. Good shine to that. Look at that. Awesome. Jose Ramirez, greetings from Cleveland. That's a PC card for myself. I'll set that one aside. I'm a big Cleveland fan. We got Carlos Santana, BGO, Hanniger, Schwarber. We got Greg Maddox insert there. Judge Carlson, Lowry Stanton Turner. Uh, another Ichiro, that's an Ichiro insert there. Willie Mays, Warren Spahn, Santo, Kyle Mueller, Jeter, CJ Abrams. There's a Stephen Kwan rookie. Very nice, not too bad. We'll open up our next five packs of archives. Pretty good. Got a serial number card, a PC card, and a nice rookie of Julio Rodriguez. I'll imagine if that was a parallel of Julio Rodriguez, you'd be hitting big. That's a that's a good card there. Am I likely to make all my money back from opening these packs? No, there's no way. 
highly, highly unlikely unless there's just a huge card in here, a one of one autograph of big name player or rookie or whomever. That's really the only way to do it. And it's, again, highly, highly unlikely. Here we go with our last five packs of archives. Here we go. We got David Peralta, Duran, Merrifield, Luis Gill, rookie. De La Cruz got Guerrero Jr. Insert, Bohm, Chapman. A couple other base cards here. Babe Ruth, Suzuki, Varsho, Lopez, uh, Ronald Acuna. Greetings, postcard. That's a cool one. JT, Mookie Betts, Verdugo, Guerrero, McCarthy, Kowser. Got a shiny card coming up. Another, that's Vlad Guerrero Sr. there. The insert. Nothing now. We ended up with the Whisper on the Archives cards there. We've got a couple of these inserts. Let me sleeve up these ones. The Jose Ramirez is for my PC. Not a very expensive card. That's probably like a 10 cent card there. The Mancini one's pretty cool. It's got a big old scratch on it. I don't know if you can see that on the camera. Yeah, you can kind of see it right there. Kind of scratched up, but it is a serial numbered card, so I'll count it uh, towards the goals. We're still looking for some big cards. Hopefully we can pull a big hit in this video. We did get an autograph though, which is nice. All right, up next, let's go ahead and crank out the Gypsy Queen packs. Looks like we have, we got 10 packs of 2021 Topps Gypsy Queen. Uh, this is my first time opening up 21 Gypsy Queen, which is pretty cool. So we get to see what these are all about. Maybe I know the autographs and the hits kind of look pretty cool with these ones, as do the parallels. I've seen the green parallels and the blue parallels, the indigo. Uh, I know there's like, they've got the weird pair, the weird variations that is where they like swap the logo or it's like missing a nameplate or missing. It's weird stuff like that. This will be the last, last pack here. Before we uh, open up the next five. Looks like we got lots of color going on in there. So let's see who we got here. We got David Garcia, rookie. Goldschmidt, Snell, Chapman. We got a Moustakis, green parallel. Tatis, Olsen, Castillo. Uh, Daniel Jet Johnson, rookie card. Howard, Chris Bryant, green. Nola. Looks like we got a purple of some sort coming up right behind it. We got Paredes, Abreu, Marchand. Rizzo. We got Sam Huff, rookie purple. This number It is numbered at 250. Very nice. Sam Huff, rookie purple. All righty. We'll take that. Please hat green. Got Wilson Contreras. Oh, we got a mini that just fell out there. Uh, Brian Anderson, captain insert. Tejada, Ryu, Stella, Aquino, Joey Gallo, green. Lots of green parallels. It's pretty common here. Stin, white, uh, Reese Hoskins, green. Arias, Hazard. I'm sure I missed some sort of like nameplate or variation swap. I'll check the backs if there's anything that's wild going on here. Okay, sometimes they have like gum stained backs. I've seen those in the past before. Uh, let's go ahead and open up a couple more packs here. Our next five packs of 2021 Gypsy Queen. These came from two different blaster boxes. So take that as you will if you have any uh, odds predictions of what we can get. So here we go with our next five packs and last five packs of 2021 Gypsy Queen. Looks like we got some sort of teal parallel down there. Profar, Bias, Horner, Carrasco, uh, Abreu Green, Magigal. Uh, we got a Max Scherzer. This is like a Terror to the Diamond insert. Cano Green. Uh, yeah, missing nameplate variation. That's a rookie of Seth Romero. Kind of cool. I don't know how rare those are, but I, I guess I'll sleeve that one up. Michael Harris, or Monty Harris, excuse me. I messed that name up. It's a green parallel. <clears throat> Got Bo Bichette green. It's a nice one. Brantley, Robert, Correa, Walsh, Jeff McNeil. This is like an aqua. This is numbered. It is numbered out of 199. Very nice. Jeff McNeil, aqua there. McKinstry green. Very nice. We got two serial numbered cards from our Gypsy Queen packs, which is awesome. The Jeff McNeil Aqua out of 199. And we also got the Sam Huff Purple out of 250. There's our two parallels there. It's a good looking parallels. I like this. And we got the missing nameplate of Seth Romero. I don't know the odds of this. I don't know if they're super rare or not. That one kind of stuck out to me. And that was the only one we got. So I'm guessing they're kind of rare. Bunch of greens, a couple more inserts there. All right, we'll move on to our next product here. We'll do uh, Stadium Club, 2022 Stadium Club. We got five packs of these. I did an eight blaster box break of this product on my channel a little bit ago, and that was a lot of fun. We did pull some big cards in there. 
So I've seen this product a little bit too many times at this point, but it is a lot of fun opening up. CM Club is still my favorite product that gets released every year. Love the photography, love the design. The parallels are not much to write home about, but it's just the base set that is just amazing to me. And it's a lot of fun. So here we go with 2022 Stadium Club. We only got five packs of these. Let's see what we can get in here. The cards will be flipped all every which way. So we got a Brian Reynolds Sapia. And Rodriguez. These ones are flipped all around. We got Royce Lewis, rookie. Honus Wagner, base. David Wright, red foil. And these ones are all flipped around as well. Eloy Jimenez, Ozzy Smith. That's a great card right there. Really, really cool photograph. That's a nice one there. Bob Gibson, Hoskins, Brooke Robinson, black foil. That one's pretty nice. These ones are all flipped every which way. Dale Murphy, Jim Abbott, Kirillov, Manning. Got a Sapia of AJ Alexi. It's a rookie card. And flip all these over. It's one thing I don't like about these ones. Ryan Mountcastle. Isn't that a rookie? Oh, that's always was last year. 2021 was his rookie. That's Ryan Mountcastle red, second year. Josh Lowe, then Luis Gill. So nothing from Stadium Club. A couple of parallels, but nothing to sleeve up uh, that was worthy to sleeve up. All right, next product here is the one I'm most excited about to open up. 2022 Topps Chrome Platinum Anniversary. The reason I'm so excited is because there's, well, there's no inserts in this set, which is really unique. There's tons of awesome parallels in this. And the player that I PC, Bob Feller, is in this set. So hopefully can pull a Bob Feller card of any sorts to have for my own collection here. I've had a lot of success opening up this product. I pulled a couple autographs from this set. A Mike Schmidt autograph, actually. Spoiler alert, if you haven't seen that video. We also pulled a couple other awesome things from that video. So if you haven't seen it, go ahead and check it out. But we've got five packs of this. Hopefully find something pretty cool. Maybe a serial numbered card. Maybe another big time autograph. That'd be pretty awesome. But here we go. I do see some color in there already. Pretty sweet. We got cards flipped every which way, but let's go ahead and get started here. Gavin Sheets, Yastrzemski. We got Bruce Suter, Centian. We got Marco, Marcos Diplan, rookie blue, Harmon Killebrew. Glenn Otto, we got a uh, refractor here of Drew Ellis. Those are not numbered. Gary Sanchez, Freeman, Phil Negro. This one's flipped around. Pujols, Acuna, Stanton. We got a Sean Murphy. We got a Ryan Mountcastle. Scherzer, David Wright, Prism. Teoscar Hernandez, Lou Gehrig. Ooh, look at this one. This no oh, it is numbered out of 100. Even get it focused there. Yeah, it's numbered out of 100. Lou Gehrig, like blue cracked ice, I think. I don't know, but look at that one. That's pretty nice. Lou Gehrig. I'm going to leave this one right up right away because it's a chrome. I want to scratch it up there. Very nice Lou Gehrig there. We'll end it out with a Dick Allen Connor Wong. So... No Bob Feller, but the nice Lou Gehrig is going to be awesome to go towards our goals. A couple other parallels there. We'll set the Lou Gehrig in the really good pile that we have growing pretty quickly here. We've got lots going on in our really good, or really good. I'm not saying it's like super good, but we still got lots here to go. Um, we've got a lot of these Series 2, but let's go ahead and crank out these Series 1 packs real quick. These are from the dollar store, so there's not actually anything you can pull from here. I don't think you can get uh, any inserts or any parallels from these. So not really hoping for much. We're just going to open these up real quick just to uh, check them off the box. I think, can't you get like yellow parallels from here? Or is uh, that no longer a thing? I don't know. I can't remember. Maybe these are just... Uh... I don't really know what you can get from these. I just know you can't get too much. There's only five cards per pack. We got five packs of it. So here we go. We got McKenzie... This one's flipped. These ones are flipped around. Pujols. Yeah, these, uh, I'm guessing, these aren't real too crazy here. This is a nice Quan. I like Stephen Quan. Yep, so these are just going to be base cards. Nothing too crazy from here. I thought there was going to be some yellow parallels, but I guess I was wrong there. So nothing wild from those packs. We'll move on to the next product. We'll open up like these kind of, uh, well, there's not many of these products over here. This is 2022 Heritage High Number. Another good class. I pulled a really nice chrome refractor out of this product already. Or is it like a black chrome refractor of Chris Bryant in a couple of videos ago. So we got two packs of these. These usually don't produce me well. I say that as I get a Julio Rodriguez rookie card. Pretty nice. Pretty nice one there. Strider rookie. Is that a variation of some sort? 
There's not a variation, but that's a nice Strider rookie. I'll set that one aside. And nothing in there. We got two good rookies, though. I mean, you can't ask for much more. If you're not going to get a parallel or a crazy insert, you might as well get it of uh, two decent players, a base rookies, Julio Rodriguez, Spencer Strider. Very nice. Let's leave those two up. Now, these ones, you can get yellow parallels. This is one pack of 2022 Donruss. You can see I got it for a dollar from a reseller there. You can only get yellow parallels. These are from Walgreens, I think. And we get one yellow parallel. Let's see who we got in it. Kershaw. Stroman, Ivaldi, Shane Boz, rookie. Corbin Burns, yellow. It's a good parallel. I love the look of those. But uh, they're not serial numbered or anything like that. We'll do two packs of Allen and Ginter from 2022. These, these, uh, Bob Feller is also in this set, but I haven't pulled anything crazy. I haven't pulled a single Bob Feller card, and I've opened up tons of these blaster boxes. So let's see if we can change that today. Here we go. Martinez, Winder, Larry Doby. That's a PC player of mine as well. Not as big as Bob Feller in my personal collection, but I do collect Larry Doby cards when I can, so that's a nice one. Tom Glavin insert. Got a North Cascades National Park insert. A couple other names. We got a Victor Robles. This one was flipped around. Is this a short print of something? It is a short print. We got a Turkey Club sandwich. We got a Tim House mini. And then a Lucius Fox rookie card, so... Yeah, nothing wild from there, but we did get the nice Larry Doby, which I will sleeve up. It's going to be for my personal collection. Love to see that. I love getting PC cards when you pull them yourself. That's always fun. All right, let's open up two packs of 2022 Topps Chrome. Easily the worst product I have opened up in a long time. I've never gotten anything great from it. I mean, I've opened up, I think in one video, it was six plaster boxes of this. I pulled just about nothing from it. Basically nothing. I pulled one rookie auto go. That wasn't worth much at all. So let's see if we can get anything here. Eloy Jimenez Refractor. Uh, we get a Heart of the City with Merrifield. And then a Jake Berger rookie Sapia. Yeah, that's usually how Chrome goes for me. Nothing too crazy from there. Let's see if we can make it up though. We got two packs of 2021 Donruss Optic bonus packs, which is pretty exciting. Maybe I should save these for later. Maybe I'll save these for the end because I know there's going to be some good parallels in there. We'll save those for the end. Let's open up all these packs of 2023 Series 2. I think there's 11 packs of these. Hopefully we can find maybe a gold card or something cool. Maybe a commemorative patch or something. I hope we can get the royal blue parallels in here, which is always cool. Okay, there we go. We've opened up six packs. We'll open up the next five in just a second here. And here we go. This is my first time opening up Series 2. So I don't really know what rookies are in here. We do get an ace card of Spencer Strider. That one's really cool. Stars of MLB, that's one in every pack. And yep, these cards are flipped every which way, of course. I mean, the top's flip is inevitable. There we got a Jordan Alvarez home run challenge card. Miguel Cabrera, Stars of MLB. Let me know if I miss anything crazy. I think Topps has done a good job at least flipping the cards that you're supposed to notice. Um, just so that you don't miss them. You get a Gunnar Henderson rookie, Stars of MLB, which is pretty cool. Bo Naylor rookie, that's a fun one for myself. And we'll keep going here. Nothing too crazy. We get a blue parallel, Joe Musgrove. Uh, Gabriel Moreno rookie, Stars of MLB. Nothing wild coming from here. We get a Rafael Devers, Dominican Republic, World Baseball Classic card. We got Alec Manoa, Stars of MLB. And nothing crazy coming from here. Quite the strikeout. Buster Posey and then Manny Machado. So yeah, quite the strikeout with, with those cards there. We'll open up the next five. We'll say these packs are super, super flimsy. Like... They open up real easily, like they just rip right open, which uh, I always thought was kind of interesting. But here we go with our last five packs, 2023 Series 2. We got some shiny in here. That's going to be a serial numbered card. We'll see who it is of. Francisco Alvarez, rookie. That's a pretty good one. Logan O'Hoppy. And we get a, oh, almost dropped it there. Victor Reyes, blue sparkle. This is numbered out of 999. Oh, I'm covering it up there. Yep, 999 right there, which is pretty nice. Pretty nice indeed. We'll take that. Serial numbered card. Looks like we got some more shiny in here, which is pretty awesome. Oscar Gonzalez, stars of MLB. 
flipping through these base cards quite quickly. I normally don't flip through the base cards quickly. We got a Jackie Robinson. Oof, that's a cool one. Legends of the game. I've never seen this insert. So I will sleeve this one up. First time seeing this one. Pretty nice so far. Yeah, I normally don't flip through the cards pretty quickly. But just because we have 100 packs to be opening up, I want to make sure we have time for everything. This one is flipped around. Harold Ramirez. Ah, that's why it's a rainbow foil. Got a Yoshida. Rookie stars of MLB. Pretty nice. Corbin Carroll rookie. My goodness, I've almost flipped right past the Corbin Carroll rookie. Forgot he was in this set. Man, wouldn't it be nice if we got a Corbin Carroll rookie parallel? I think so. Let's see if we... We do have some more serial numbered stuff coming up here. Will Benson rookie. And here we go. Rookie. Luis Liberato. <laughs> Sorry, I butchered that. Number to 799. This is a purple speckle of some sort. We'll sleeve that up because that is a serial numbered card. We're going crazy on the serial numbered cards in this video, which is pretty nice. And some more base cards to go towards completing the base set, which I haven't done yet. Ooh, we get a we get a hit here. Julio Rodriguez. Oh, it's a <laughs> I thought it was like an actual hit. Uh, no, it's just a, it's a commemorative day patch. Father's Day of Julio Rodriguez, which is a pretty cool one. This is not like a game-worn patch or anything. Wow, that one's like kind of... I can't really see on the camera, but the corner is a little bit dented. We'll slide it into this penny sleeve. So that that doesn't really count as a hit. That just counts as uh, just a regular card that we got there. So we got a couple serial number cards there. No hits. We've, we've gotten one hit out of this video. It was like early on there, but that's a couple other good stuff for us take a look at a bunch of inserts here which is always fun okay we got a lot going on on the screen let's open up uh well, we got these tops chrome packs that we'll crank out 2021 tops chrome i feel like this is the most open product i've ever opened in my life 2021 tops chrome i've just opened up so much of it i mean i can't even like dozens and dozens and dozens of blaster boxes of this stuff over and over i've gotten some decent stuff i pulled some good autographs some good parallels from it, but it, you know, it's bound to happen when you open up so much of it. So I'm looking for Andres Jimenez. I'm looking for a rookie auto, which is uh, likely when you open up this product. These packs aren't as easy to open up as the last couple of products that we did. But we'll open up all 10 of these packs. Yes, we have 10 of these to open up. We're going to get lots of the pink parallels, lots of the sapia parallels, but hopefully we don't. Uh, and we're going to get lots of like re refractors and prisms, but hopefully we get something else. We get a little color in there. We get a little serial number action, which would be amazing. That would go towards our goals. Uh, mentally, I'm not keeping track of where we are at in the goals. I know for sure that we are, we are still missing some of the big hit cards. So we're going to need a big hit card here very shortly. So here we go with 10 packs of 2021 Topps Chrome. Let's lead it off here. Hoskins, Paredes. Getting Alejandro Kirk, Ricky Sape. Yeah, I'll sleeve that one up. He's a good catcher. Take that one. Aaron Nola, Refractor. We got a Glaber Torres Pink. And we'll there got a Dick of DeGrom insert there. There we got a Zach Granke reverse negative. Those are kind of rare. That's not um uh, serial number, but it's kind of a rare one. We got a Joey Bart rookie sapia as well. That one's not bad. Sleeve that one up. Dean Kramer. Willie Castro insert. We get a Ian Anderson rookie sepia. That one's also not bad. So like the 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 easy going parallels are kind of nice here. Castro, Jake Arrieta, Pink, Mookie Betts, Bieber, Tony Gonsolin, Refractor, Grisham. We get a prism of Cattell Marte. Good looking card there. I love the shine on that one. Brandon Lowe, or Brandon Lau. I'm not sure how to say it. Shohei Otani, the seven hundred million dollar man, which is absolutely crazy. Prismic Power, Rendon, then Joy Bart, rookie. So we got a couple parallels there. And the the reverse negative is kind of cool. Hopefully, I'll put the odds on the screen for that one, because so I know those are those are kind of hard to pull. You don't see those pop up too often, but nothing serial numbered. That's okay, because we got a couple more packs to be opening up here. Alrighty, let's open up Topps Big League from 2021. Kind of a fun product. I mean, I haven't pulled anything huge from me. I don't think I pulled a serial number card from this yet. I've opened up lots of it. But you do get some cool parallels. You get the orange parallels. You get the blue, electric blue parallels, which are not numbered, but still kind of cool. The checklist is nice. I wish Tops would continue this product just because it's good for kids. It's really, really cheap. And you can still pull some fun stuff in it. Really colorful, good checklist. You get all the big names in there as well. Some cool inserts. So we got five packs of 21. Big League, I've opened up lots of this in the past. 
Kirill off Devers. We got a Mike Trout wanted insert. It's kind of nice. We got a Mike Trout, Stanton, Luis, or excuse me, Luke Voigt and a Brayu. Uh, that's kind of a nice one. Bueller, Snell. Uh, some more leaders cards. We get an Austin Hayes blue Juan Soto insert. Don Mattingly orange. Uh, some more triple cards there. We get a defensive Wizards Lindor. AL Ward leaders. We get an orange parallel, that one. And we get a blue parallel of Kyle Seeger. Souvenirs. Shoko Akiyama orange. And nothing crazy. Buxton and uh, Kohi Arihara, rookie orange. Nothing crazy from the big league. His cards are kind of toppling over on the side here. We've we got so much of these going on. But we are coming down to the end, folks. With the break here, let me open up uh, the Topps Gallery. Do the Topps Gallery packs from 2022. I've had some decent success with this, opening up the monster boxes. Um, got a couple autographs. Actually got my first ever redemption opening up this product. Let's see if we can repeat that with a nice redemption, maybe. Possibly. <clears throat> then we'll end it out with these bonus packs here. These optic bonus packs, which would be pretty exciting. Last pack of 22 gallery. Let's see what we can get. The 21 gallery produced us an autograph. Let's see if that can do us the same. Kind of hard to tell when there's parallels because all the colors are kind of different. But we're going to start it off with Pujols, Ichiro. Lodolo, rookie. Andre Jackson, artist proof. Griffey. Some good names, good checklist. I've always liked a gallery a little bit. Cedric Mullins. Wander Franco, rookie. I won't sleep that one up. It's not as uh, high of a stock now. Joey Votto, printer proof. Thundor, Springer, and Kellenic. Wow. Gallery didn't do us much there. Well, didn't do us anything really at all. So we'll clean this up. We'll open up our optic packs to end it out. Alrighty, we got five packs of 21. Donruss Optic. Kind of a fun product. You do get some, uh, get the chance at some rookie autographs, some prospect autographs, some good parallels in here. Kind of hard to pull some serial numbered stuff though, um, but I have pulled autographs from it before. It is fun. And these packs are not easy to open up. Here we go with our last pack before we get to the bonus packs, which I'm very excited to end out on. Five packs, 21 in optic. Here we go. Shane McClanahan, rookie. Chisholm, Jamel, get a Cattell Marte. That's not a parallel. It's just part of the base set. Christian Yelich, mythical insert. This one's like, oh, it felt thick for some reason. It's kind of, kind of warped a little bit. Get Jacob Degrom, lights out. Brent Rooker, rookie. Uh, Aaron Judge, team minus insert. That one's kind of cool. Actually, I'll sleeve up that Judge. Judge is a really popular player. Cabrera, Dalbeck, Robert, and then team minus Rafael, Devers insert. So optic. The base stuff didn't produce us very much besides this uh, judge insert. Leave that one up. But we are going to end it out on two packs of optic bonus. I think these are the pink parallels or the green ones. I am not too certain. We'll see if uh, there's anything good in here. We'll do kind of a reveal for each of these packs. Yep, so they are pink. See who we get in here. We got Ramon Lariano. Dansby Swanson and Jose Garcia. Okay, nothing crazy from those pinks. Let's see what we get in our last pack of the video, folks. This is our 100th pack that we're opening up. I want to take a pause here and thank you guys for sticking around for this long. I really appreciate it. We opened up a lot of packs and had a lot of fun so far. Of course, we're going to be doing a recap at the end, so stay tuned for that if you're interested. Here we go with our last 100th pack of the video. See if we can get something big here. We got Bryce Harper. Ooh, we got, oh, it's a uh, Diamond Kings. We got Bryce Harper. Bryce Harper and <laughs> Jesus Sanchez. We got double Bryce Harper, though, which is kind of a nice one. So there's a bunch of pink ones there. Let's take a look at some of the bigger stuff that we got. Let's go ahead and start our recap right now. Here's all the cards that we decided to sleeve up, which is pretty nice. Got a decent stack there. Aaron Judge insert. Uh, Alejandro Kirk, rookie Sapia. Grinky, uh, reverse negative there. Joey Bart, Rookie Sapia. Julio Rodriguez, Father's Day commemorative patch. It does not count as a relic. We got some serial numbered stuff here. Luis Liberato out of 799. Corbin Carroll, Base Rookie. We got Victor Reyes, Blue out of 999. Jackie Robinson, Insert. Uh, we got a Larry Doby. That's for my personal collection. Julio Rodriguez, Rookie from Heritage High Number. Spencer Trider, Rookie. 
Lou Gehrig, I think this is our lowest numbered card. I might be wrong about that. I'll double check. Lowest numbered card pulled in the video, the Lou Gehrig out of Chrome Platinum Anniversary out of 100. We got a missing nameplate. I'm not sure how rare this one is, but I decided to sleeve it up. Seth Romero, rookie. Sam Huff, rookie, purple, out of 250. Jeff McNeil, aqua or teal, out of 199. Another Julio Rodriguez rookie card. Trey Mancini, out of 199. Jose Ramirez, greetings from Cleveland. That's for my personal collection. Mark Melancon, green ice, out of 499. Roger Maris, 70 years of tops insert. Corbin Burns, gold. Johan Duran, rookie, uh, blue camo. Mike Trout, printer proof. And then, of course, the Laoti Tavares, green autograph, out of 99. I guess this one is technically the lowest numbered card. It's our only hit from the video, which is kind of disappointing. Opening up 100 packs, you only pull one autograph. But still, tons of fun doing this. I, I think I should do more of these videos where I open up 100 plus packs and stuff like that. So that was a ton of fun. Really appreciate you guys tuning in and having this fun with me. I really appreciate it. If you guys enjoyed it, please like and subscribe for more of these videos to come. And this has been Eagle Man. I'll see you guys next time.